Now hold on a minute. What in the world does El Cid have to do with James Bond? Oh wait, I remember. Wasn't it that ingenious piece of sound editing? Yes, it's coming back to me now. This is quite clever and a nice entry for the first trivia piece of the advent calendar. During the editing process of the first James Bond film, Dr. No, British sound editor Norman Wanstall was desperately looking for a thundering sound effect when Bond escapes his cell on Dr. No's island through the ventilation shaft in which he is almost washed away by masses of water. Wanstall remembered that his colleague, sound designer Gordon Keith McCallum, had created the ideal sound one year prior to Dr. No, while working as a re-recording mixer on Anthony Mann's epic historical drama, El Cid. McCallum had created an ear-shattering sound that was supposed to resemble galloping horses. How convenient that both were working on Dr. No. And so, without further ado, one stall asked to borrow the sound track of El Cid which is how the sound effect ended up in the first James Bond film. Compare for yourself.